Hey YouTube, we're doing the BO3 Enhance mod as you guys told me to do in the comments of my Revelations video. As you can see, we're loading into a whole new menu system here as Rick Toffman's getting his uh, guts eaten. Paws not like that, we're talking zombies there. I guess you might out the gutters as uh, let's go into zombies itself. And we have uh, Takio smoking the pack, probably of all his ops that he has uh, smoked. And uh, let's see if there's any new gobble gums. I don't, that's something I do not know. Oh, it looks like, oh, they're all in one, I see, okay. But, uh, weapon kits, okay. And fans features, don't know what, the, I, I says not to mess with it if I don't know. So let's, uh, not mess with it. Uh, what maps can we do? Oh, the DLCs, okay, and then standard, obviously. And then I guess Savvy Chronicles and shit like that. Let's do Origins. And, oh yeah, um, the new Gobble Gums. Okay, so there are new ones. But they, they're all under one category, so we just gotta look for them here. Uh, join the party, that's from BO4. Right? Yeah, BO4, that sounds about right. Um, oh, the, all the wacky ones I see. Well, here, we'll, we'll just set up our gums, and then we'll go in and we'll have uh, some fun on Origins. Alright, we're in. Okay, so we have a bunch of options here. We have 4 plus space for enhanced vision. Uh, let's do that. Oh my god, what the fuck? Um, nor the other agents okay, so the I'm Mr. Murdoch Daredevil, and I guess I can see, but, like, the zombies aren't even highlighted. I, I thought they'd be highlighted. Um, yeah, we should probably restart. Okay, back here, because, uh, yeah, I couldn't turn it off, so we're going to have one goal. Let's get the ice staff, and let's just see what round we can get to, and let's fuck around. Ooh, new font? I like the font. Uh, perk I'll look off the wake up. Let's see if they added any perks at all. Okay, no new perks. Subtitles from myself in the game, which is interesting. Oh, I like the sound when you kill zombies. Oh, that's that's sexy. I like this. And I kind of like the the plus 130 zombie kill. Like I kind of like the kill feed. Is is that weird that I like that? Should I feel dirty? All right, let's see what we get here. Ooh, raindrops. Oh, let's see what weapons are here. Let's hit the mystery box. We'll get rid of this bozo and let's see what's popping. Throw that. Come here. Want to get all of our points. I don't think I got any kills from that Widow's Wine, which is odd. I feel like I should have. Oh, the little sound from even using the death machine is making my pussy wet. Oh, oh, that was hot. That was hot. All right, predictions. Uh, I'm hoping we can get the Mark II. That'd be cool. Um, BMP. Oh, and it does give you the mule kick sign, so that's cool. Like that. Because from what I was told about this mod is it's kind of just like a, you know, like the small things that add up. Like it's just an enhanced version, especially this. Oh, I love that sound. What even is that? Hold on. Is that the bug of purifier? Oh my god, it is. And I can use this to revive down teammates. Okay. I, I, I didn't expect this to be. Is this is just a new power up, I guess. All right. <laughs> okay, let's, uh, let's drop another fire so see what we can uh what we can conjure up oh my god the mg08 remember when mr dalek jd leaked this what a time to be alive when that was the biggest of our worries was mr dalek leaking shit from Treyarch. do you think they ever trusted him with any more information after that like ever after he leaked that probably not respectfully they probably learned from that well then again jason blundell that might have, what if jason blundell's firing was due to that or part of it i should say and Draken with no attachments is actually so sad. I don't know if I, I'm allowed to... I saw that the Watchmen attachments were changeable, but hey. And we have eye candy. Oh, cute. Oh, and the robots are names. That's not normal. Oh, Panzer. It's round eight, I forgot. And I just realized I still have eye candy on. I actually have to turn this off. And whoa, wait. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, so we buffing the Panzers? Because I know this man should not be this strong. Especially with the double tap MG08 as his opponent. His op, as you would say. All right, chill out. Why am I? All right, I gotta change the colors. These colors are trying to fucking bother me. There you go, slammed. We're gonna smoke the Panzer Pack tonight, boys. Yeah, can I please see regular colors again? That'd be cool. I don't even know why I put. I thought I, I put this shit on. I don't even know what I thought it'd be. It just makes them all look like toys, like fucking plastic. One thing I gotta talk about, guys, is the comments in my Revelations video, where some of you lovely people. But also you grandpas were mad I was trashing the flamethrower. Because it's the best gun when getting high rounds of World of War. Okay, right. We were on BO3. 
That game came out nearly a decade after. Maybe more, I don't know the math. I'm honestly making it up as I go. But it had to be over, over no, okay, maybe not a decade, all right. Like fucking what, 10 years, 15? This is not World of War anymore, all right? That, that game was set where Stalin was killing potato farmers and Adolf was not doing his paintings anymore. That was post-painting arc for him, okay? BO3 had, had re on Revelations had the Apothecan and the Thunder Gun and alternate ammo types. The uh, flamethrower was not going to do it, brother. It was never going to do it on Revelations. Even if it was a World at War gun mod, that wasn't going to do it. All right, but guys, who do you think actually shit in OJ Sing? And I'm going to be honest. Would you would you snitch? So say right, say right. You know who it is. Say you know who shit in his sink and you're part of that group. Is, are you snitching? Number one, are you snitching anyway, right? Let's get that. So let's say you're not snitching, right? So that's the first thing we're talking about. No snitching. So then let's say Noah starts to pressure and is like, hey... Andrew, I know you shit in my sink. Are you then gonna be like, nah, bro? I, I gotta, I, it wasn't me, but it might have been Timothy. I don't know. Like, are you ever gonna snitch or are you gonna go down? But and if you don't know, are you gonna throw out an accusation out if you are getting pressed and someone thinks it's you? And then it goes back to the same question: Is were you the one that shit in the sink? And uh, most times out of ten, if you're in this situation, you probably shat in the sink. But I'll always comment down below who you think shat in OJ sink. Should I send an email out to all the Z House members? who were there and should I just email them and just say who shit knows and <laughs> I should just I should email them and say if you shit in Noah's sink uh respond if you don't respond I'm assuming you shat in his sink and then I'm gonna make a clickbait video that says I know who shit in his sink and it's gonna be all five it's gonna be like six youtubers that just combine to make one massive human shit and what's even funnier is that when I google it that like nothing shows up like when I'm like who shit in OJ's sink there's like some things about it right there's like a twitter post that's like someone shit in OJ's sink and people are like what and there's like one reddit post where someone's like, I think it's Liam. <laughs> like, and apparently because Liam has shit problems, so Liam's the one that shit in the sink. <laughs> like, instead of it being like, he has, they make it sound like instead of it, uh, him like having stomach problems, like with shitting, that he has a shitting problem, like this shitting serial killer where he shits in the spots he's not supposed to. Like, yeah, Liam's got a problem. He, he shits in shelves and drawers and cars. Like, dude, I, I don't know if that's enough. Because apparently Lex said on stream that, like, Liam has these really bad stomach issues for, like, when he uses the bathroom. As if that says, like, means anything for his stomach issues. But whatever, dude, right? Like, literally whatever. And since I'm actually uh, starting to practice doing some of the old uh, IW maps a little bit off like recordings because uh, I want to do all Raven Spaceland done when I want to do all of these uh, IW zombie maps like do all the easter eggs I have two done and then uh, I have them all recording stuff like the videos uh, I, I do want to upload them but I want to do them like chronologically and oh my god I'm gonna die uh, chronologically in order but you know what I also want to do is I kind of want to email like Lee Ross like and some of you might be like oh he's not going to answer you I didn't think Lex would answer my email when I, like, a while ago we made a video together, like, just talking zombies on Discord for, like, three hours. Like, for so long. I kind of want to just talk to Lee Ross and ask him some questions about, like, IW and, like, why some decisions were made and, like, what the whole process was. Because I'm so curious to, like, talk to him. Like, we had plenty of interviews of him, like, before the, like, when the game was coming out and stuff like that. But, like, I want to talk to him now and I want to, I want to know, like, does he have any interest in making another zombies game as a lead director? Because... That'd be so cool if he came back. Okay. All right, I literally just sent Lee Ross an email. Like, I paused the game and everything, and I sent him an email, and I tweeted him. So let's see how it goes, you know. Maybe maybe he'll be like, all right, fine. Maybe I'll play with this bozo. I asked him, you know, if you want to do a Q&A, and maybe uh, you guys could ask some questions. I could have some questions and, you know, have a fun time. Maybe he'll play some IW Zombies with us, and maybe we'll make a little stream out of it, and everyone can join up, and we'll have, like, a little, a little four-man on Zombies in Spaceland, and I might actually uh, press him if he tells me, hey man, why don't we play Attack or Beast from Beyond? And I'll be like, alright bro, we can only play the boss fight game mode for Beast, alright? We can play Mephistopheles, maybe he'll know like a cheat. I actually wonder if, since he's a dev, do you think that he can like, his like characters like, got cheats? Because I've seen that before, you know what I mean? Oh my god, did you just see how quick they died? That was so weird. Um, like how some devs like can enter god mode or like their name is like colored a certain way because they're a dev Do you know what I mean? Like it's some like H1Z ones like I've seen clips of that shit. Uh, is this gonna work? All right, there we go All right, so we just gotta go get souls and then I staff will be upgraded and then we'll just see if we get to some high rounds I kind of like the just the why do I have did I just have a perma perk? Did you guys see that shot on my gun just now? Like go back and look Did you see that shot? I think perma perks are in here 
because the fact that I just had that tells me it's a permafrost. Oh, and I got the purifier. But like, you guys get what I'm saying. Like, you guys. Wait. No. Oh, the game closed. I'm on my desktop. Yeah. All right. Honestly, I like the mod. I'm gonna play it again. Hopefully, it doesn't crash on me again because I'd like to do a lot more with this. So, if you guys did enjoy this video and this mod, check out the description. I got all my socials. Peace, guys. We'll see you in a couple days. All right. Bye, bye.